G'day everyone, Viv here. Welcome back. I hope you're all keeping well. Quick update for our terrain uh, scenery set, the terrain project. I've put together a small little generator. It's very, very basic, but it's somewhere to start. So I thought we'd have a look at that, some of the techniques that I used for that, and then uh, my inspiration folder. So let's get cracking. So here's that little generator. It's just a whole bunch of uh, circles all glued together. I've scored some lines in there, so when we paint it up, we get a little bit of detail. But um, it's just very simple. I haven't gone to town with the uh, engravings. I just wanted to keep this piece uh, fairly simple until we sort of move further on. We can always come back and make a, a more elaborate one. So that was fairly straightforward. You saw uh, I used the, uh, the plastic bowl to make the circle shape on some pieces of foam. I then uh, rounded both sides of the foam and then cut it in half. I used a tin can to make some uh, other shapes, some smaller little bits, which I then also rounded both sides, cut them in half, and that's given me the basic shape. Now, for the lines that I've scored around here, I'm terrible at uh, free-handing lines and all that sort of stuff. So what I did is I traced the bowl on a piece of paper. I then scanned that piece of paper, and then in Photoshop, I shrunk that circle down so it's a little bit smaller, but still the same diameter, and then uh, tested it. It wasn't small enough, so I made a smaller one, and then printed that out, glued it to a piece of card, and there's my template. So now I'm able to put that template, which you can see I've marked some edges here, one on this side, one on this side. I'm able to line that up on the piece of foam, and then score around that. That way the diameter of my line around here is the same diameter as the uh, uh, bowl that I originally started with. And I uh, just eyeball it and the distance between here and the outside and here and the outside is, is pretty much the same. And then on the table, I then just gently score around that line. Just gently once, come back, do it again. And then three or four times and you'll get a nice deep line. So that's how I managed to score those circles in that foam that are the same diameter as, uh, as the generator piece. So there's that. Now my inspiration folder, like I said, I've, I've fished around. I've put them all into a little folder here. Um, different sorts of designs from the internet that I've seen. Just so I can flip through them, get some nice ideas. And one of the images that I really love, I don't know who the artist is, is this set of terrain up on the top there. I love that look, uh, it's uh, very simple to do, it's just a whole bunch of uh, geometric shapes cut and glued together. So I reckon we'll tackle that next. So there we go, very quick update and uh, the first piece of terrain for the terrain uh, towel set. Just a very simple generator of sorts, we could embellish this a lot more, but uh, I think for the moment uh, this will be fine until we move forward and then discover some new techniques and a different style and then we can always come back and make uh, better ones of these. But I'm happy with this so far. There's the first piece done. Um, we'll paint all of this up together once the whole terrain set is finished and uh, I think we'll get on with some bigger structures now using that image that I showed you as my inspiration. So uh, thanks for tuning in again guys. I'll catch you soon. See ya.